Thanks for joining us tonight at 6. I'm Laura Thomas. Tonight, two inmates who escaped from the Union County Jail are back behind bars. The sheriff says with the help of a neighbor nearby, they were spotted in the woods this morning. Deputies caught Ashley Tyler and Kenneth Lipsy Jr. this morning around 9 near Wages Road along Buffalo Creek. A judge in Union County denied bond on a new charge for escape. This is video from Tyler's hearing this afternoon. 7 News reporter Christine Brown is live at the Spartanburg County Detention Center with more on their future. Christine. Laura, after a lengthy search, the Union County Sheriff's Office says that it is a big relief to have these two men back in jail tonight. And the plan now, they say, is to get them to a higher security facility here at the Spartanburg County Jail. They had pretty much just run out of gas. It took 17 hours for deputies, sled agents, and canine to track these two escaped inmates down. We got a call from a homeowner who had spotted some footprints in his area near where he lived that wasn't there yesterday. So we went back in, picked up the trail out of the water, and found the two individuals laying down in a wooded area. Ashley Tyler is accused of murdering his family member and is a convicted sex offender. Kenneth Lipsy faced several drug charges. The two shared a cell phone in jail and managed to escape Friday evening through a chain link fence and by jumping off of the jail's roof. We'll have to go back and evaluate how how this happened. They were just checked on by the correctional officers because they had just got through serving dinner. It wasn't like they had a lot of time to, to prepare to get out. The sheriff says their team put in every effort to get the armed and dangerous men back in custody. We got information out as quick as we could on the escape. People immediately knew who we were looking for and, and uh, what they were wanted for. And we followed up on those tips all during the night. But to see everybody's passion this morning to get here, they were ready to get to work. And this isn't the first time the Union County Sheriff's Office says they've dealt with this kind of trouble before. You don't want anybody to ever escape from your jail. This is not the first time that there's been an escape uh, from this facility. The sheriff himself says the jail is not up to standards and that he plans on addressing those problems soon. There's some security flaws in our, in our facility and we need to get those corrected. Now, the sheriff says it'll be have to be a later time when he talks to us about the changes he would like to see at the Union County Jail to prevent this from happening again. As for the inmates, where it's unclear right now when they'll be moved to the Spartanburg County Jail, but if they're convicted on these new charges, they could face several more years in prison. Live in Spartanburg County, I'm Christine Brown, 7 News. All right, thanks for that update, Christine. Meanwhile, an outburst.